Hiya guys, Tom back again with uh, my third and final installment of Summer Dreams. Um, three fragrances, three categories. Fruity, green, you can go check them out. And this is floral. Um, they're a little bit more expensive that I know I get along with, but don't get much love and I think um, they should get more attention than they do. So for this one I've picked Maison Francis Gurgeon's uh, Lumiere Noir, um, a rose-based fragrance. But I think it's much more than that. It's got a lot of spices, which um, aren't as easy to detect because they're so well blended. You've got rose, patchouli, artemisia, caraway and cinnamon. Um, the, uh, the patchouli, caraway, um, cinnamon um, give it a little bit of body, but you don't notice them as much because it's as if all these spices have been submerged into a big jug of cold ice water. Um, so they lost their pungency, but they're still there. Cinnamon, um, with a little bit of the sweetness from the rose, tame all these spices. Um, instead of it being a curried mess, it comes across like a really spicy, um, pleasant cologne um, that's a little bit sweet, but you don't know why. It's got um, like a, a cold mineral uh, water feel to it, um, or even one you'd associate maybe with glass or metallic object without having that metallic tinge you'd associate with, uh, with other fragrances that are known for that. Um, so you've got, on the skin it comes across uh, like a phenomenally persistent light cologne. Um, you have the spices and you have the sweetness um, but you don't notice it being floral or spice. Um, those that come close to you are going to get that rose a little bit more. I found out because um, when I thought it disappeared off and I was in bed at the time uh, later on that day and I was just breathing on my arm and all of a sudden this beautiful rose just opened up in front of me. Um, I think it's perfect for high-end social events where you need just something classic, non-offensive, um, along the style of a cologne, but you don't want to wear something that other people smoke before, like Neroli. The rose is a really good alternative. And you still have the patchouli um, and a few other spices that give it interest, like you do in a lot of other colognes. But they've never been done like this. Um, and I think people are going to really appreciate it, especially those that are close to you that will get that that 3D rose um, and it's going to last right through the night and when you go home it could also jump off into one of the other categories. Um, I think if you like fragrances like Creed Silver Mountain Water but wanted something a little bit more uh, formal, a little bit more spicy, not as sweet, you should really really try this. Um, I think it's a, a beautiful fragrance, great for special occasions. Um, there is a manly rose out there, it's this one. Um, I think it's the best rose out there. Um, followed closely by, I think, Rose 31. It's another magnificent one. Um, if you want something a little bit more butch and, I don't know, maybe easy to wear, you'll have to decide yourselves. But, um, hope you like this one. Let me know if you've smelt it before. Make your own Summer Dreams video, something you'd like to have that is out of your reach. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye.